All right, welcome back everybody. Boy, this has been a fantastic stretch of uh, fall weather here with sunshine and comfortable temperatures, uh, crisp air at night, not a lot of wind, at least in the central and western part of the state. Eastern Montana is still dealing with some wind, but east wind, seven miles per hour, psh, that's nothing. Temperatures in the upper 60s. Great Falls also into the upper 60s with a light wind. Anytime it's in the single digits, uh, here, that's not so bad. Seven miles per hour out of the west. How about Cup Bank? One of the warmest locations in the state, only topped by about a degree in Thompson Falls. And it is cooler the farther east you go in Montana, but also continuing off towards the east on Interstate 94 through the Dakotas. If you're headed that way, you might run into some snow tonight and tomorrow. Strong wind still in eastern Montana. We do not have any uh, high wind warnings though. We had a wind gust recently uh, earlier this afternoon to 51 miles per hour in Baker, now only 44 miles per hour. But the wind will ease up some over the next few hours here. However, you're looking at uh, still some wind across the state tomorrow, more on the order of 10 to 20 miles per hour. There will be a front that goes through Friday night into Saturday morning, and Saturday will be pretty windy out across the plains, but the wind really drops off the farther west you go in the state, even west of Lewistown and west of Haver there, uh, looking at much lighter wind uh, through Saturday afternoon and Saturday evening. Lake wind advisory, wind issues here still into the Dakotas, and yeah, that is some snow that is heading down into eastern North Dakota and northern Minnesota right now, but from snow there to a few fires still burning here in Montana. The Sinholm Fire, south end of the Missions, up over about 120 acres. And we do have a couple of prescribed burns. This is good weather for doing prescribed burns. We have uh, no wind and uh, cool temperatures at night. Little lookout fire, prescribed burn up here north of Libby. That's not a prescribed burn. That's been burning a lot of the summer. The Kootenai uh, River Complex with about 530 acres of growth in the last few days. There's a big fire, the Cedar Creek complex there into the uh, Cascades, also a couple of fires into the Washington Cascades that are contributing a little smoke to the sky, but otherwise not really that bad uh, fire situation here in the West right now. And that's a monster storm in the eastern half of North America. Some flooding, some snow, a lot of wind around that area of low pressure. And uh, here we'll See a little system come down tomorrow, increasing the cloud cover. I know you're looking at the rain off towards our east there and some snow again into the eastern part of the Dakotas and Minnesota. But here comes just a couple of showers, light spotty showers tomorrow evening, tomorrow night, possibly lingering into early Saturday morning here. But really, most of the state will be drying out through the morning hours and the afternoon will be very nice. Here's the forecast for tonight. Not as cold as last night. A lot of the state was right down uh, near the freezing point, either in the upper 20s or the lower 30s. We're safely above the freezing point for more areas. A little more wind, a uh, little more in the way of some cloud cover increasing. There's the front coming through late on Friday. Clouds will increase, but it's still not that bad of a day, 60s and 70s. Friday night, Saturday morning, a few isolated showers, a couple flakes of snow up into the mountains. Cool, windy in eastern Montana, less wind, warmer temperatures the farther west you go in the state. Sunday, a little breezy, but that's still it's a pretty nice October day now that we're beyond the middle of the month here and then heading into Monday. Also, nice weather, 60s and 70s. This stretch continues here with potential for some changes more clouds, more wind, maybe some rain by late next week into next weekend, but still is a ways away. We've got a stretch of nice weather continuing.